Grok is turning out to be the jailbroken, renegade version of all your other chatbots. Ask ChatGPT when is it appropriate to listen to Christmas music and you get a very rounded, politically correct answer. It'll tell you it depends on your personal feelings, your cultural background, yada yada yada, and other things that'll put you to sleep. But Grok's got a bit of a personality. It'll tell you straight up whenever the hell you want. Grok has another very important edge up its sleeve. It has access to real-time data on Twitter. Oh, I'm sorry, X. This means Grok will give you an analysis of things as they happen in the Twitter sphere. And that, combined with the fact that Grok doesn't really have a gag order, makes it a very powerful and a little scary tool. Unlike your other models like ChatGPT and Gemini, Grok will actually engage polarizing political theories and even conspiracies. This is just the kind of stuff you can get away with if you own the entire friggin' company. The Gemini fiasco at Google sent shockwaves throughout the company because Google, as a publicly traded company, is extremely accountable to the public and its shareholders. But Grok can afford to be rogue and shake a few boats.